and he was cut off his right eye. You know, he still had some doubts, some bats in the belfry, so to speak. Some doubts in that mind. This is why you can't outbox Thurman. Look how quick he is. In other words, it's not just about the ability. It's about what's in the mind. I haven't seen it so Oh, Colosso came forward, cut the gap, and now an exchange here in that neutral corner. Yeah, he came forward, Colosso, but he got counted. He so... Combination from Keith Thurman right back to a southpaw right jab from Colosso. Thurman, his only chance is to land something, but the advantage is to Thurman. He likes the box. He likes to use the ring. Fourth, we have a southpaw former titleist in the ring right now as Keith Thurman is teeing off on Louis Colazzo. Good series of an offensive attack and included a right hand to the body. And now Colazzo's covering up. Speaking to the fight plan, that right hand landed early in this round because Colazzo moved his head. You got Thurman knows where he can find Colazzo. Or more importantly, finds his head. Unruled. Make two mouthpieces. Why? In case you lose one. Well, maybe they should make a new move. Bring two belts. Palazzo with his best work. It looked like it hurt him in the body a little there. Went to the body and had success here at the end of round five, and now he's trying to chase down the unbeaten Keith Thurman. Looked like he hurt him a little bit to the body, and that's the right place to go. Downstairs, and he did. Look at Colazzo on the attack he's against Keith Thurman. Thurman's to looking to wrap up. That's where you want to go if somebody's moving. Take the air out of the tires. Louis Colazzo is a bigger underdog in this 12-round fight than Buster Douglas was against Mike Tyson. From putting any more water in his basement. And that's exactly what Colazzo. No bell. Hey, as long as we got a good fight in the ring. Doesn't make him pay the price. Now on the inside, going to that belt line, and a short left hand on the inside from Colazzo as Thurman comes back, sweeping with a left hand that was off the mark. Colazzo takes a step forward, fires off that left eye of Louis Colazzo as this round comes to an end, and a right hand from Keith Thurman as Colazzo fights up. Oh, sharp right hand from Keith one time. Cards and back in the fight, but it has him. The people in the corner, locker room, they could have told him tonight's your night, baby. You know why? There was an upset. Colazzo has been cut from head clashes. He's been involved with head clashes. Oh, good sharp. Career. And he's been shaken up several times in fights. You want to know what? Stopping the fight shot. based on you know that what? cut. You I'm could shot. hear the exchange between Dr. Carlos Rodriguez. He, he gave it to Tell us Asamenos. They're stopping the I'm fight shot. based you on that what? cut. You I'm could shot. hear the exchange between Dr. Carlos Rodriguez. He, he gave it to Tell us Asamenos. And the fighter, the fighter Louis Colazzo. Colazzo has stepped in to wave off the contest at one second of the eighth round for your winner by technical knockout and still welterweight champion, Keith Wattai.